Hi, I'm Chad Hutchings, and this is how to create a real drummer style drum beat with the step sequencer in Cakewalk and Cakewalk Sonar. So here I have two drum tracks that both have the same step sequencer pattern. And if I double click on the step sequencer pattern on the second drum track, and then click on the play icon in the step sequencer pane, you can hear the drum pattern. And if I double click on the step sequencer pattern on the first drum track, then click on the play icon in the step sequencer pane, you can hear the drum pattern with my Real Drummer effects added. So let's add these Real Drummer effects to the second drum step sequencer pattern. All the notes have the same velocity, so let's make them more realistic. Click on the arrow icon on the F sharp 3 closed hi-hat cymbal row header. The parameter section now appears and the parameter drop list says velocity. Each vertical line below a step that has a note on it shows the volume of that note. Now click below the top of some of the vertical lines to reduce the volume of those notes. Now, click on the arrow icon on the D3 snare row header and do the same. Then click on the arrow icon on the C3 kick row header and do the same. All the notes are quantized, so let's humanize some of the notes. Now for this, I like to keep notes on the same step in sync with each other. So press down the control key and press the A key on your PC keyboard to select all step sequencer rows. The parameter section now appears above all rows. Next, click on the parameter drop list and click on time offset. The ruler shows where zero on the vertical line is. Click above the zero mark to move the step behind the beat. Click below the zero mark to move the step before the beat. Now click on some vertical lines to humanize the steps.
Finally, real drummers never hit the drums at the exact same place, so the pitch of the drums changes from hit to hit. So click on the parameter drop list, and then click on pitch bend. The ruler shows where zero on the vertical line is. Click below the zero mark to lower the pitch of the step, and click above the zero mark to raise the pitch of the step. Click on some vertical lines to humanize the steps. If you enjoyed this video, do give us a thumbs up and click on that subscribe button. Cheers!